Okay, I think that's enough of, of, of that little jam right there. I will it will turn down Nokia ringtone Arabic one hour just a smidge. <laughs> hey, coffee. <laughs> I'm glad you <laughs> I'm glad you like my setup. I worked very hard on this. I spent a solid 20 minutes earlier today. I spent I spent a majority of today just absolutely just absolutely messing with random crap to put in this. It's a it's a lot of fun to <laughs> to put in garbage like this. <sighs> but yes, I will I'll I'll let them cry for another 30 seconds or so while I Finish getting everything set up on the capture card front. Make sure I don't accidentally short circuit my PC and, and all that goods. And then I think we should be good to go. I've never actually tried doing a... Like, I have multiple, like, little transition things on here because, like, I don't particularly want the weeping of a pre-stream thing to be on the same bunch of sources as my um, uh, <laughs> as my main stuff because I'd be a bit too crowded so let's see if this messes it up oh why why is the chat sideways <laughs> okay let's <laughs> let me um, uh, there you go Perfect, you can see the Mario in real life sightings. <laughs> Fantastic. Everything is working properly. Now let's see if it works. Come on. Ah, there we go, baby. Let's just... Okay, perfect. We have audio. I'm not too sure if it's too loud or not, so y'all will have to go. Uh, <laughs> y'all have to have to confirm. Oh, that just might be me. I might be getting some delays. Whoa, what? Eighty-two percent. That's huh. Why is it being so bad? Huh. So yeah. <laughs> Not too sure how this is going to go. I'm hoping this will go well. This should be fun, though. So we, we got the Mario real life, the real life sightings in the corner there. So I will... I will make this title Mario IRL. Just so everyone is, is warned of him. See if I can get those alerts on the top, though, because that's not where they're supposed to be. They're supposed to be above. Okay, let's just pop that out here. Nope, don't grab the entire thing, please. Make this at the gosh darn top. There we go. That should work. Okay, now, let's finish my warning. Perfect. <laughs> it's fantastic. I might... Hmm. I'm debating whether I should move chat so y'all can see the Mario IRL sightings. Scary. Because they are quite spooky. And I'm hoping that... <laughs> Did I get the word out more? I might just leave it there for now. It'll pop around. But let's get this party started. I have not played this game in years, I think. Like, when I initially went back onto it, like, when I was doing tests, there was a bunch of old files from back when I played it when I was a kid. 
I can tell because all the file names were just key smashes, so either I knew I was gay from a young age, or I just was too young to know how to spell. Hey Mario, we got a letter from Princess Peach! With the two Luigi voices there are, there's the, the, the nasally one from, like, just sort of popular interpretation, and then there's the, um, uh, the, the gravelly, um, Mario TV show one. I like that one because I can sort of do it, but it does make Luigi sound like he is either suffering from very late turn lung cancer or is rapidly aging before our eyes. So <laughs> you can choose either or. I'll read it to you, okay? All right, let's see. I'm throwing a party at my castle today. Mario and Luigi, I would be honored if you could attend. Many guests from distant towns are hoping to meet you. There will be tasty sweets and all kinds of entertainment. I hope to see you soon. Sincerely, Peach. Oh, howdy. Um, well, I haven't streamed for a while, too. It's been a month. I, I was off during all of Christmas break. Uh, the curse name. The curse name is Mario IRL. I really would like a um, uh, cause like with Zelda, there's an excuse for Hyrule to look different every time because of like it being through tons of generations and stuff, but I want to know why Mushroom Kingdom never looks the same. I want to know if there is a, a link situation with Mario, Luigi, Peach, and Bowser. Oh, shoot, I missed that line. That's fine. Yeah, Say, Mario, why don't you go see Princess Peach? I'll go later. I'm thinking I'll mingle for an hour. If you press A in front of the door up there, you can open it. Every single time it gets taken over by Bowser, they remodel the entire place. Okay. <coughs> okay. Apologies in advance, I am going to attempt to do a Toad voice. Oh, the game volume? Yeah, sure. I can do that. Wow! I've never seen so many guests from different parts of the world in one big place! I mean, you can hear some stories about places you've never been to, huh? I don't have a hammer yet. What's in here? Oh, this is some, uh, taste tea. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be cooking with you a lot. Oh, absolutely, but <laughs> they, they do need to revolt. <laughs> Thank you for the follow the lizard blank. I'm so glad I got, I finally got the alert noise in Demma message to work. I was fi I was mingling with that for like an hour last night. Oh, hello there, Mario. I'm Tasty. I really love to <coughs> cook. You may not know this, but I cooked all the food for this big party. I made all of my most delicious dishes. Hard about. But oh dear, I got so much of my cooking that I used up all my ingredients. There are literally... There's a whole cabinet of ingredients behind you. Uh, Tasty inhaled too much flour, and her voice is very hoarse right now. Now I have to go shopping. I'm going to avoid talking with many more toads, so I don't absolutely obliterate myself. <laughs> she can only eat or drink things she baked. <laughs> well, this is the only introduction introduction that you should have. <laughs> She can't drink water because she didn't bake it, so she can only drink boiling water because that is considered cooking it. So she has absolutely demolished herself over years of being Peach's chef. I can't wait to, um, uh, 
figure out the voices for all the partners. I do have sort of an idea what I want for, um... Goombario. That's the first guy. Goombas, like... I guess everyone has their, um, their own personal headcanons for the voices. For Goombas, I don't know how to phrase this, but all Goombas look like they sound they sound like their name is murphy i can't explain it any more than that but that is all i can describe for how i think goombas speak i also really want to know why mario never has a hammer he gets one every game but i guess he just goes through those things like hotcakes like i don't think i've ever with a U or with an N. How do you spell Murphy with an I? Like M-U-R-P-H-I-E? Oh, okay, yeah. I guess that is how you would spell Murphy. Uh, Murphy with a, with a Y. <laughs> Murphy. Oh, Mario, you came to the party to see me. You're so sweet. He's looking out the window. Give him some space, Peach. He's, he's keeping his distance for some reason. I was just resting a bit. It gets tiring greeting all those guests out there. I mean, it's more tiring voicing the guests out there, but I, I get your point, Peach. Nobody will bother us here. Shall we relax and chat? Just the two of us? <laughs> it was a lovely day today, so I'm sure it's comfortable out on the balcony right now. Would you accompany me, Mario? So I was thinking about this last night. Why is Paper Mario, why does he not speak? Like, like with all the, the mute video game protagonists out there, there is always, like, there's there's like Link, uh, there's, there's, um, there's Chell, but they never talk about Paper Mario. He doesn't speak, he, he makes the occasional, oh! but like, that's really it. He, he only knows uh, exclamations of shock, he does not know speech. But, but Paper Luigi speaks. Which is what confuses me. I think in the Mario universe, only one brother is able to speak. And in the, um, he, he may, yes, he makes known sounds. Like, in the, um, uh, in the Mario and Luigi series, they both can make noises, but they can't speak. So the speaking role is split up in half between both of them. So they are allowed to, yo, yeah, he does do, a, he, go, he goes, yeah, occasionally too. But like Mario and Luigi, they do their their alien Italian <laughs> Italian voice thing. Um, in so in Paper Mario universe, Luigi stole the speaking role. Oh, why are you alright, Mario? What in the world was that? I got so distracted by um thinking about the logistics of um Mario's speech that I did not notice what happened. Oh my look, Mario, it's still daytime, isn't it? But I can see stars outside. Mario's just really, really shy. He doesn't like to speak. <laughs> Long time no see, Princess Peach. Bowser, but this can't be. It was you who made the ground shake just now, wasn't it? <laughs> Italians aren't giving, aren't allowed to speak in the Mario universe. It is their um, they do not have the right to. Whatever did you do? Yes, that was me. I lifted your castle up into the sky. It's sitting on my castle now. Was weren't expecting that, huh? Also, Cammy slash or Kamek is trans. You see Cammy for um uh, uh Paper Mario sixty four um and TTYD. She never shows up after that. But in um Sticker Star, I think maybe Color Splash and Origami King, you see Kamek. Kamek is a trans guy. And I and I'm 100% right on that. That's not an opinion. It's true. Huh? What is Mario? What a shock! Huh? Not really. I... <laughs> but I don't know what this Bowser voice is. It's morph morphing into something else. Not really. I expected you to turn up right on cue. You're just as annoying as ever. Unfortunately for you, there's nothing you can do this time. Haven't you learned your lesson by now, Bowser? You're not even that popular anymore. You weren't given a boss role in Origami King. You can never defeat Mario. Why don't you give up already? Yeah. I really... <laughs> G 
good. Um, I want to know how old Kamek is. Because he is older than Bowser by a long shot. So he is either ageless or in Origami King, he is just a wrinkly old man. Just like a, a prune of a Koopa. <laughs> true, true. I've had my problems in this past, but this time is different. This time I'm gonna win. Bowser's got a sore jaw right now. He's 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 stretching it out at the moment. Let's go. I sure hope I win this, guys. I really hope nothing bad happens. Mario, you can do it. If you lose this battle, I'm never inviting you to a party again. I really want custom sound effects for this game. So like when Bowser hits you there, you just hear a, just a really, really crisp slap. Am I getting the timing wrong, or am I just not supposed to have timing in this one? In <laughs> dog years. Do uh, seven dog years is one human year, so... What's what's 30 times seven? 30 times seven. So <laughs> Kamek is 210 years old. Okay, good. I thought it was just really bad. Good old Mario, always fight. You're a thorn in my side. But today your pathetic little attacks won't beat me. Take a look at this. Look what I star stole from Star Haven. It's the Star Rod. Oh, howdy, Pricer. Hope you're doing good, Chloe. That fine piece of work has the power to grant any wish in the whole wide world. Bowser wished for everyone to go to hell no matter what. And when I use the Star Rod to increase my strength, even you can't beat me, Mario. So what was Bowser's wish? He didn't ask to be unbeatable. Or did he? He just asked to be more powerful. Like, how specific did he get? Like, I wish to become more powerful, but not powerful enough for me to be unbeatable because I still want to have a risk of being beaten by the end of this. How do you like that, Mario? Sure hope I don't die here. Oh, I didn't. I'm glad I was hoping then. <laughs> that that that's what granted him this power. Is that all you've got? How sad. You best take some vitamins, cause that didn't hurt at all. Mamma mia. I got fucking killed. When he died, this is when Mario went to real life, which is from the, the sightings behind the chat. How is Peach okay? She was covering her face. Did she get her, her, her eyebrows singed off? Oh no, Mario. <coughs> oh no, Mario. That wasn't my Peach voice. Oh no, Mario, get up. Yes. Oh yeah, I did it. I finally did it. I beat my old rival, Mario. Yes. <laughs> um, Peach is is just made out of the same material as oven mitts. She's the only thing not made out of paper. Nobody knows why. That's why she's the ruler. Congratulations to your victory of viciousness. That's why you're the king. <laughs> as long as I have the star one, everything I wish will come true. No one can stop me now. <laughs> Do you think... Do you think Peach utilized her girl power to survive a point blank, blank fire blast from Bowser? Well, 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 I, I, I guess I might as well get rid of Mario. He's no good to anyone now, that's for sure. Are we gonna see Twink soon? Oh, sh oh shit! <laughs> Fucking killed him! Oh no, Mario. Mario. <laughs> Mario is not a twink. That was what Bowser wished for. He wished for everyone to uh, to go to hell no matter what. Well, the Paper Mario series has been getting more 
fatal over time. Like, characters are dying more and more each game. Prologue, a plea from the stars. This looks like the opening to Yoshi's Island. The same sort of floral. Yeah, Luigi's the twink. Mario is not. Oh shit, I got all seven star spirits right away, guys. I did it. Well, doesn't everyone technically die? Like, Paper Mario, or Super Paper Mario, uh, Paper Mario game with the highest body count. Entire cast dies once. Uh, Luigi dies like six times. Um, a lot of people. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna say who exactly dies because I think it's a lot of spoilers. But Paper Mario game with the biggest body count. Oh, thank heavens! He's been gravely injured, but I think he'll recover. But Bowser has a Star Wars. Now he's mightier than Mario. It's so. Oh wait, that's not him. It's hope. It's hopeless. All is lost. Everybody just calm down. His arms is... <sighs> Gather around everyone, send Mario power. Yeah, that's it. That's all we can do right now. Mario! Please get up, please. It really sounded like someone fell somewhere around here. Are you blind? Oh. Who could that be? This red shirt, this hat, this mustache. You know, this really looks like the one and only Mario. It couldn't be, could it? The real Mario? Hey, hey, wake up. Come on. Up and at him. Oh, no. <laughs> He's fucking dead. Oh, oh, what am I gonna do? I have to hide the body. Dad, I killed a man. <laughs> he really is just fucking dead. I'm as the, the star spirit. It's something very important to do. This is the princess of the from the Mushroom Kingdom. This is the. Yeah, you sure as hell don't have the strength to talk right now. Mario, I need you to come to shooting stars on me. Please, Mario. There's no spirits of blue. Oh, whoops. They'll be waiting for you at the summit. Oh, I died. I saw what hell looks like. God was crying. Oh, Mario. I'm so happy to see you awake. <coughs> Sorry. I had a tickle in my throat. You haven't opened it for days, Jesus. Everyone's been worried sick. This place? This is Goomba Village. It's a tiny village that's just west of Toad Town. The only residents are me and a single family of Goombas. So it's not a town. It's one house. That's not what a town is. You're just two groups of people that live in a place. <laughs> he, he was practicing for Super Paper Mario. The Koopas are a nice family, and the, and the, and the family are just the nicest folk you'll ever meet. I mean, the, the girl did leave you for dead out in the forest, but forget her. They're the ones who found you unconscious in the forest and carried you to here to get better. Oh! Huh? A star with a mustache? You're saying Star told you to go to shoot in Star's stomach? No, I saw nothing like that. I sure didn't see anyone come in or out of this house. I'm not sure. I'll, I'll have to explore the town um, to, to, to check to see the living accommodations of it. 
I want to marry you. Maybe you just had a dream. Hello, oh, maybe not. Could have been some sort of message from a star spirit. They live in Star Ape. A giant, or a, a big sentient talking star. Hmm. Maybe perhaps that's from the race of sentient stars that live in the place named Goddamn Star Haven. You think, Toad? Surely Star Star is the nearest place to Star Haven, so that would make much sense. Hmm. Who knows? And any case, I'm glad to see you've covered. I have not. I'm very, I'm very badly internally bleeding. I know the Goombas would be happy if you paid them a visit. Fuck you. Okay, we got one house. <laughs> one very big house. Yeah, uh, didn't you know, um, uh, Paper Mario is just a, um, uh, a euphemism for Christianity. Uh, the stars represent the, the, the pieces of Jesus Christ, and beating Bowser represents, uh, getting baptized, of course. Yeah, I have to get, I'll get the Goombats. I don't have a hammer yet, so I can't. I, I can't hit the tree, I don't have a hammer! Sup? Oh, Lance likes Mario, so nice to meet you. My. I'm so glad you wake up. I can't tell you how worried I was when you were just lying there asleep for so long. What's in here? Oh, I can't open that. Okay, this is the this is the one who left me for that. Mario! <coughs> Mario, you look better, I'm so glad! Wait, what was her voice? It was like a young Southern girl, was it? I was really worried about you because you were lying there in the forest and you didn't open your eyes at all the whole time. It was like you were <laughs> asleep or something. Okay, let's talk to Goombario. Okay, what's my voice? I need to figure I need to figure out how to vocalize the, the Goomba Murphy voice that I have in mind. Hey Mario, I'm Goombario, I'm your biggest fan. Yeah, I, I like all my voices. If I can't hold them for long, will and always will slowly convert to country. <laughs> you don't know what this means for me to meet you. Oh, you don't know what this means for me to meet you. Seriously. <laughs> oh, another old man. I can't wait to sound like I'm dying again. <gasps> oh, Mario. Hello, dearie. You may call me Guma. Oh, that's oh, that's the grandma. I'm Baguma Grandmother, so that's where I got my name. Ho, 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 ho. Have you already met my grandchildren? Aren't they sweet? Especially little Gubaria. Why, she just looks like I did when I was young. Ho, 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 ho. Where's Goompa? I know there's a Goompa. Oh, here's Goompa. Oh, you startled me. Hmm, yes, Mario, isn't it? So you've awakened at last. Good, knew you'd pull through. Call me Goompa. I'm the Goomba grandfather, so I'm Goompa. I'm sorry, but would you mind giving me the details later? I'm pretty busy fixing the veranda. It's really hard with no arms. Really, I'm just shimmying in front of it and hoping something happens. Who's this dude? You look like your name's Paul. <laughs> How do Mario feel better? That's Bowser. Uh, How do Mario feel better? Feel free to rest in our house. It's not such a shabby place. It may oh whoops, it may look a little unkempt at the moment, but I'm fixing all the earthquake damage. Why did why did Mario's parents surround him with mushrooms? Are they trying to are they trying to like decompose him? In fa in fact, I just spent ages fixing this gate. You what? You what? You have to leave right now? Oh, shooting star stomach. Something important, no doubt. Well, I believe that the stomach is near Toe Town. Nah, it's not gonna last till 5 p.m. I'm not able to to go that long. Have a good, have a good time at work, Marcy. I'll see you later. Well, I believe the summit is near Toad Town. If you take this road straight, eventually you'll reach the Toad Town, the home of Princess Peach's castle. Nope, that's what the sky is now. 
I believe that shooting star stun is just beyond there. It's too bad you can't <laughs> stay. I feel like I just met you. Do the cause. I know. Come back and visit if you can. Best of luck, Mario. Hee hee hee. Oh, it's her. <laughs> Anna, it's this way. Mario, I can't believe you're on your feet after taking such a beating from Lord Battle and King Mario. <laughs> King Mario. Oh yeah, what's today's new pog about? I saw it yesterday. Oh, heck yeah. I saw what yesterday's was. I didn't see what today's were. <laughs> yeah, hi, anyone, all right? I was smart to come here and check on you. Well, what? What's that, Daddy? What's that fly weird flying thing? Weird? You rude little thing. I'm a beautiful Koopa with a beautiful name, Cabin Koopa. It looks like the new pog looks like mid gag. Like they're going like Hoo! I wish I had time to teach you a lesson, brat, but no. Let Cammy kill a child. That's what we've been asking ever since. That is what the modern Paper Mario games are missing. That's what I've been telling Nintendo, but they have refused to listen to my emails. Mario, hear this! It is useless for you to try to say Princess Peach ridiculous. Laughable. I wrote laugh though. As you've seen, King Bowser is more powerful than ever you can deal with this time. Here's a gift from him. Okay, but how fucking funny would it have been if it just it, it just crushed the, the, the Goomba dad there? Like, he's right there, and there would be no <laughs> repercussions for it story-wise. It would be perfect. Mario. Oh, that, that is not Cammy. Mario, you will kneel and weep when you see the wonderful changes King Bowser's made. Your world is ours now. Bleh. You didn't let me do my line. Cammy. Um, I just... <coughs> uh, I just fixed that gate. Nobody say gate to me. Cammy Koopa, that fiend. Did you hear what she said about the princess? It doesn't sound good. I hope nothing's happened to her. Oh. What, what, what? Bowser went and kidnapped Princess Peach again? Why am I surprised at this point? <coughs> oh, unbelievable. And now you have to go to Shooting Star Summit to help save her, right? Uh, this could be a problem. You see, I don't respect monarchies. Dad, we've got to just do something, right? Mario's going to save the princess. No one else can do it. Yeah, there's a... There is so many more collectibles in this game than I thought. I did not think there was going to be 80 badges, like, the star pieces and the recipes. And there is still tattles in this game. Like, trying to scope out what's considered 100% for this game is actually um, a lot more complicated than I thought. Oh, see you around, Chloe. But, like, it's surprisingly not very, like, precise. I, I found, like, six different things saying different mean meanings. Yeah, the badges do have doubles. I'm going to grab them all, though. But, like, people were saying, like, you don't have to do the recipes. You don't have to, um, uh, collect all the duplicate badges. Uh, one thing I don't think I'll do is I don't know if I'll do all the tattles. Like, because there's no way of recording them, I think. And, like, I, I guess I'll try to do them. Like, because it's also just kind of useful to have in general. But I, I'm not really too sure if that amounts to anything. Because really the only way to track a good majority of these is... Um, is on Mario's blackboard in his house, which has badges, star pieces, recipes, um, and the other three are just sort of mm, more obvious things to entail. Maybe we can break open this this block with Goombas and big hammer. Why does he have a hammer? Oh, he's using it right now. I think he's using it right now to fix the veranda. He's really struggling. He can't can't wrap his feet around it. <coughs> oh my god, this, these Goombas are slowly killing me by making me do their voice. Oh no! <coughs> oh, I drank water, man. <coughs> I'm gonna start stounding like Elstar by the end of this thing. What? <coughs> it 
was an attempt to kill me this whole time. <coughs> okay, I'm good now. Guys, Goomba's fucking dead. <coughs> Sorry for the coughs. Okay, I'm good now. Oh, my back. <coughs> That's not his voice. It was Burger King foot lettuce. Who's that? That you, Mario? I remember a great crashing noise, and then the veranda collapsed, and I fell. <coughs> did you fall, too? Just stepped out the door into thin air, did you? Well, we're both okay. Problem is, we can't get home because this block is in the way. This block. This block shouldn't be here. Well, this is a problem for us. Oh, here's a question for you guys. <coughs> question for you guys. Does Mario start out at level 0 or level 27? Because I was really debating that when I was setting up the, uh, the level counter down there. Mm, a hammer? Oh, of course. Huh? Where did it go? I was using it to fix the veranda, so it's likely around here somewhere. Hmm, nowhere to be seen. I guess it must have fallen somewhere over there. Mario, we better look for it. Oh, I can't even hit that yet. Please, I just want to... I just want to play the game. The hammer has got to be somewhere close by. It looks just like this. That is a, a pathetic handle. Like, I could get two fingers around that before all the space on it is taken. Look for bushes that might cover it up. If an exclamation point appears over your head, you can press A ah! to search. <laughs> he, um, uh, he said the ones and zeros that made up the binary of the image, of course. Oh, I can I can hit start. Um, oh, I do start on level one, so I will go and fix that then. Guys, look at that. Look at all that progress I made. I'm rocketing through the game. I'm a real gamer now. Coin! Coin. Coin. Mario is rich. Oh. I found the fucking hammer. Time to bash some brains in. Oh, there we go. That's it. That's the hammer. I'll wager that if you can use that hammer, you can break the block that's in our way. You can also use the hammer to hit the trees and make them sway. Sometimes stuff will fall out. You can use it by pressing the DIE! I'll fucking kill you, old man! Where do you hide the money? I'll beat it out of you. I woke up today and just violence. Kaboo. Oh. I'm never going to give this back. Oh, well now, I believe that's the dolly that Goombaria said she lost. She'll no doubt be overjoyed if you give it back to her. Emphasis on if, you little shit! So many people lose things all over the place, you know, it almost makes one feel like looking around everywhere. Is this your wealth? Can't you, like, eat the doll? Or is that, like, a glitch you can do? No, that's, that's from a glitch video I think I saw. Because I know if you like, you can do some sort of glitches to just straight up eat the doll in front of Goombaria. Hmm, well, we found the hammer, so I guess we should head for home. No shit! Oh, he fucking died! Yeah, ouch. Finally, an excuse to beat a child. Oh, 
don't you be Junior Chirpa's voice. Hey, who are you guys? This is my playground, idiots. Nobody sets foot in here without my permission. No money. Prepare to start crying and defeat Master Junior Chirpa. Mario, this is Junior Troopa. He's the boss of the neighborhood gang. Why is this infant in a gang? <laughs> a bit of a bully. He saw an old man and instantly just threw hands. A bit of a bully, obviously. And yes, I, I will keep the nasal voice. He's more bark than bite. You can beat him easily. Just boost yourself up and don't take any lip. <laughs> the one person gang. You, you tell me you don't know about the, the, the Goomba Village Yakuza? I'll stay right here behind you and watch your progress. Oh, excellent. Good move. Go on. Oh, fuck! Time to club an infant. That's why it's called a town with only two people. It's just um, it's just to launder money for their for their goon nut sales. Yeah, I still can't do time attacks yet. I'm just getting warmed up. I I never played master mode, so I'm not too sure. Mario, you've got him. Keep it up. Go on. Alright, you asked for it. Say hello to Junior Trooper Special Attack. Full power! Oh, Holy shit, he's going Super Saiyan. Oh no, he's just playing. Oh. This child is going to fucking kill me. Never mind. I, I surpassed the infant. Mario, that was wonderful fighting. You you really trounced that the child. You got star points every time you beat an enemy. Every time you save 100 star points, you'll go up a level. Always try hard to get points. <laughs> the plumber has surpassed the infant. HP, a bracket, art points, close bracket, would fully recover. Wowee. What's down here? Can't break that yet. I'm too weak. Oh! Shit. I just got, I just got severe brain trauma from that. Loves hitting his head on rocks. Well, uh, I guess Mario doesn't anymore. He doesn't want to anymore. Heads up, Mario. I see bad Goombas ahead. They're loyal to, Brow <laughs> to Bowser. If they see you, they'll attack without hesitation. If you can successfully attack an enemy in the field with a jump or hammer, you'll get the first strike when you enter the battle. Striking? Okay, why am I reading all this? I know how to play a Paper Mario game. Oh, Star Piece! Fuck! Bum, 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 bum. Please just let me do timed attacks! That's why all the um, uh, people work for him. Like, oh shit, 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 shit. Come on! 
This is the spike Goomba. See the spike on his head? No shit, I fucking see it. Be careful not to jump on him. We'll definitely get hurt. That's what the entirety of Bowser's army is. It's just a constant attempt to unionize on Peach. Oh no, I'm using the like I'm actually playing off of my N64 right now. This is my actual copy of um, uh, a Pip Mario. Yeah, I've only been playing myself. Um, like. This, like, Nintendo was basically my entire childhood. Like, my grandmother, uh, she was a huge Nintendo fan, and she has a lot of the old stuff, so, like, I have a lot of her old systems, because she doesn't really play them anymore. So, like, I, I have, like, the NES, SNES, uh, Wii, GameCube, N64, like, I got all the old, I got all the old stuff. So, like, because, like, my plan for this is I want to go through all of the Paper Mario games and 100% them, because... Over oh, Christmas, I got Origami King, and uh, I 100% of that in four days because it was a fantastic game. And it was the only Paper Mario game I ever 100%ed, even though this is my favorite game series of all time. And since I have, I think I have all the old games lying around. Only one I'm not too sure about is Sticker Star, uh, but I should be able to find find my copy of that. I I'm gonna do it all on like the original hardware and stuff. Unless, again, for Sticker Star, I cannot figure out how to do, um, uh, how to do the fucking, um, emulation for the 3DS. Pip Mario is amazing. Uh, Mothra, have you, um, have you played Origami King? Oh, Star Piece! Nice! Gotta, gotta edit that. I really wish there was a, um, a, a quicker way to edit text on OBS. Oh yeah, no, I'm not gonna say anything spoiler-wise for Origami King. Yeah, I, the, the battle system isn't my favorite. Um, really, I find the, the things to be either too easy or too hard. Um, there's a, there's a thing, um, there's a little, like, um, ring puzzle tester thing that to get one of the um things for 100 percent completion you have to be really good at so i've gotten most of the um the puzzle things down strictly just because i had to do that for a while but like yeah it's not it's not the best but really i find that like it's not a bad game because of its battle system it's a good game it's a fantastic game despite it and yes i i have very strong feelings about sticker star I played it when I I played it when it initially came out because I had played the um, uh, the Paper Mario series since like I was a kid. So and it had been like like five years since Super Paper Mario came out. So I was extremely excited for that. And then it was not good. And like still as a child who didn't particularly know how to Google things, like 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 Chloe, I'm a uh, and like. So, like, I was stuck on it for so long. I think I ended up having to buy, like, one of the guidebooks for it. And, like, um, I really don't like this about the final boss, or the bosses in, in Sticker Star. It's not about strategy. It's about getting the specific thing you need and using it. And then you basically instantly win the boss. I think for the, Fowser, the, the final Bowser fight, it's physically impossible to do that. <laughs> yeah. Like... I have not played Sticker Star in years. I remember I didn't hate it when it first came out, mostly just because I was a dumb kid and was really hungry for any Paper Mario content, but it's not the greatest. I have never completed Color Splash, though. It is the game, one game that I never beat. I played, like, three hours of it, and then I sort of just got bored and quit. Goopa, where have you... What was his voice? 
Go, Polly, you been? I looked outside, and wow, both you and the veranda were just plain gone. Go, oh, Pa, I was very worried about you, really worried. <laughs> That's valid, both of you. Sorry, kiddos. I apologize. I didn't mean to make you fret. Just take it easy now. I'm back safe and sound. Yeah, I agree. Like, I'm a... Like, I think the past three Paper Mario games have been bad or not no 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 i did not mean that that was a slip of the tongue the past three paper mario games haven't been as great but they have been improving on its own on the, the the flawed concept they've been built off of each time and i think even though it is still flawed origami king has really done the best that they can with their with this sort of new groundwork they've laid out like for i'm a for Sticker Star and uh, from what I played of Color Splash, I didn't love the overly paper aesthetic of it. Like, I, I find that that didn't do too much and they relied on it too much. But Origami King makes me absolutely adore it. It's one of the prettiest games, or like, it's the prettiest Paper Mario game. Um, I find a lot of the concepts work. I think having the initial antagonist tied so <laughs> so close to the paper theme really helps tie it together as a good addition before i forget i've decided to give you something mario wait here a minute am i gonna get a bat i think i get a badge from you i think i get like power jump but um with what origami king did it really perfected the the flawed additions that uh sticker star and color splash did <laughs> I I think if they remade um, Paper Mario 64 or TTYD in the same style as Origami King, maybe not like changing the concepts and stuff, but just like updating the art style to the more paperly look, I think that would be fanta I <laughs> I Beetle. I think that would be a fantastic game. I I went on a whole a whole rant in, in Beatles um DMs like a week or so ago about my thoughts on <laughs> origami king and paper paper mario as a whole hey that dolly you got that's the one gumbari lost she was looking all over would you give back no oh that's just me mario i guess we just give back when you're done <laughs> you know, are you trying to butter me up to to give the doll back how far are you in origami king uh bye last i checked you were <laughs> uh, last i think i heard you were in uh shogun studios you work out i study self-defense by reading books by the masters and listening to dad and goopa oh that's another thing i need to do um i have to uh, i have to go back i have to go and fight the masters oh nice oh that 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 streamer boss is really good i study oh, all right by the way and I always exercise every day so I can be strong like you. It's starting to show too. I'm getting big muscle. Where would a Goomba's muscle be? Would it be like, would it have a six, a six pack on its like little, its weird stock? Or would it be, would it just be one big muscle? I don't like thinking about musky. I'm gonna, I'm gonna Google Muscular Goomba. I'll I'll I'll, I'll intro. <laughs> I'll I will talk about my results once they come in. Hmm. Okay. They're like anthropomorphized Goombas. But. <laughs> okay. 
I, I googled, I googled muscular Goomba, and in the Google images, there's just a picture of Mario with some text next to it that says, jump on the Gumba Mario, and then under it is just a picture of Sia for some reason. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna put that image in. I like this image a lot. <laughs> let me, let me get jump on the Gumba in. Wait, is Gumba a slur? I'm making sure that is not some racial thing. Uh-oh, that is. Uh, never mind then. I take back everything I said. Uh, that's a slur. I thought it was just a random, like, an image that made no sense, but nope, it's racist. Oops. Wanna really hurt this head bonk move? It really, really hurts. We're just gonna, we're just gonna pretend that whole thing didn't happen. I just wanted to look at muscular Goombas. Why does everything have to end like this? <laughs> no! Mario, <laughs> Mario was going to get her. I'll be quiet, Goomba. You're embarrassing me. Of course it is true. Sorry to have kept you waiting, Mario. It's okay, Goompa. We're just rapping with Mario. What? Can't wait for Mario's um new single. I I, I fucking killed a child that one time. Star um featuring uh Goombario and Goombaria. Oh god, I really want to hear Mario rap now. Oh oh, rapping, huh? Sorry, I wanted to give this to you, Mario. I still, I still haven't given the doll to him. Uh, to fucking, uh. To, um, Goombari. Chloe, why'd you send me? <laughs> Chloe! I'm adding that to the Mario in real life, um, slideshow. Because that is scary. Okay. Let me just put this in the. Mario in real life folder that I have at all times. Okay. Uh, look for, <laughs> look in the Mario, the Mario in real life settings thing for, for what Chloe sent me. It should be at the very end. Oh, power jump. And I have to add this to the badges now. Properties. One. I got the power jump bad. Mario stomps on a single enemy using a lot of attack power. It can kill violence. This is called a badge. Okay, I'm gonna skip most of this. I really. Oh no, 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 I hit the two. Oh. oh my god. <laughs> no, I remember that. Now remember that you need an FP bracket flower point close bracket to use this power jump technique. Yes, I saw that. Shut up! I want to play the game! By the by, Mario, I heard from Guma. You take it upon yourself to try and rescue the princess from Bowser's clutches. <laughs> take my son, he's expendable and can maybe be used as a shield. Oh yeah, Mario can beat Bowser with one hand time behind his back. His fist is bald. You can see the fury behind those <laughs> two black pixels. Hush now, Goombario. Mario, please take this hammer and kill my son. Yeah, definitely. The years have started to weigh on me, though. I tell you, the slower back. You... Where does, where does the the back? differentiate from the lower back i want i i really want to know goomba anatomy adventure you're so lucky princess rescuing is so cool i really want to be an adventure too someday I too. oh here's an idea goombario Perhaps the timing is perfect. You are no longer a child. That means we are not liable to take care of you anymore. I'm sure Mario will agree you should accompany Mario. 
What? Really? May I go? go may I really go? Yes! Oh, yeah! Mario, you won't regret this. I didn't fucking agree to anything. Good Mario, join your party. Press down to, to make him not shut up. I really love this little illustration of Mario. He looks very confused. What the fuck is this thing? <laughs> when you're interested, just ask him. Gabari is also helpful during battles. You can attack with Headbug and you can tell you about an enemy's features and HP using his tattle ability. I really... They really made the first two partners just the exact same in TTYD. Goombella and um, Koops are really just Goombario and Cooper reskins, like ability-wise. Way to go, Go! Way to go, Goombario! Mario, I know Goombario will prove to be a nuisance throughout your adventure. Oh, I think it's about time for me to nap before you can refuse. Goodbye, so have a way of making this old boom again. Wait for me, old man! This is so cool, Mario. Let's go. But wait, your HP looks a little low. Maybe you ought to take a rest at the Toad House. I'm not sleeping in that old coot's bed again. I need goo nuts. Yeah! Say, say goodbye to your father one last time. You'll never see that old coot again. There we go. Problem solved. I have a feeling this road will be lined with difficulty, so try not to overdo it. <laughs> oh, I need to give the, the fucking doll back to Goombaria. No, I I feel like if I if I didn't um help Goombario, he'd just be sad. If I didn't give the doll back to Goombaria, that's what would create a syndrome situation. You know that badge won't do anything if it don't wear it. Okay, I'll put it on. You know, that's actually thank you for reminding me. <laughs> Here's, a fuck Here's a fucking doll back. I can't give it back. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll give it back this time. <gasps> Thank you, little girl, for the star peaks. I'll no longer steal your possessions again. I'll take this too. Fuck off! <laughs> the reason um, Paper Mario doesn't talk in these games is because he's just a complete asshole. What the fuck? That's a really fucked up thing to put outside of a a town of um uh, of Goombas. That's <laughs> I don't know how how I should feel about that. Ah! Oh, fucking me. Oh! Oh, that makes sense. And that means the toad is donkey. <laughs> uh, Pip Mario uh, points behind me, tells me to look over there, and when I do, that's when he talks. I don't need your fucking help, goodbye. I'm not gonna read every tile entry. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> uh, the Goomba family themselves are the ones who put it there. Okay, we got that. I might eat my mushroom. So I don't die. Can I eat it? Oh, I can't eat it outside of battle. What? There we go. <laughs> that would be a very powerful thing to do.
fucking love eating raw food, I can't go outside. Come for me, child. I can't wait for when I can make Gumbario fight uh, Junior Troopa for just a child-on-child -child baby fighting ring. What do I call her? <laughs> <laughs> uh, the, the Paper Mario sequel is just him dealing with horrible, horrible food poisoning. TTYD, the thousand year diarrhea. Now, any any game involving Bowser Jr. is baby violence, so a lot of the um, New Super Mario Bros. games invokes uh, <laughs> child violence. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I missed half those coins. That's fine. Go. Okay, I'll have Mario title these bastards. This is Paragruba. Obviously, Paragruba's like, it was a wings. Yeah! <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, you sent me Mario IRL images? <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. I love that. I'm going to add that in right now. I'm going to delete that. Uh, Mario in your life. Only to children, though. He, he's, he's child racist. Mario just doesn't see people or age in the in the line of battle. He just sees <laughs> sees obstacles for him to crush. I really want to know the um, like the statistics of if a Paragoomba loses its wings, it's no longer a Paragoomba. Like like if you if like somebody like walked up to you and like knocked off an arm, you're not human anymore. Like. Losing something revokes your species. Oh, that was from what? What Mario? What Paper Mario game was that from? Ooh, it's back there. Okay, let's get Mario. Up. Oh heck yeah. This is Spack Goomba. Spack Goombas are Goombas with Spacks on their heads. <laughs> Paragoombas was just a prank on Mario that grew that grew so dense that it just ended up being an entire new species. Oh. Whatever you do, don't jump on our spacks or you'll get hurt. Are you paralyzed? You can get Does like Mario jump on it and just happens to like pierce a very specific specific nerve. No. Yeah, I guess that would make sense with the paratrooper. With the paratrooper thing, that's more of a title than a thing. That's like... <laughs> um... Like Mario beats you up so hard that you you lose rank. It's like if Mario um, uh, walked up to a CEO, punched them, and then they became like a um, uh, like a desk worker. <laughs> Ooh, close call. Nice. Um, let's pop that in. What is this for? Okay, that's fine. Badge. Two out of eighty. Wahoo! 
Oh, Mamma Mia, I don't like that. <laughs> Can I get this mushroom? Eat a mushroom. Oh, sweet, that does happen. <laughs> That's a cute little detail that both both signs involved having them uh that's a cute little um, nod to the paper to side. Just pop that guy out. <laughs> yeah, I, I deleted the message last time instead of, <laughs> instead of banning it, so I had, uh, I had to take two shots to kill. Oh god. I'm not fucking that. Okay, I need to heal. Oh god, I gotta give people British voices. Oh hell yeah, I can't wait to desecrate another accent. So, are there timed attacks in this game? Oh yeah, those are always a thing. But like, did Pick Mario 64? Like, no, they have to have the time defense because there's a whole thing about getting like a hundred super jumps in a row. Oh, so oh I used that mushroom for goddamn nothing. Oh well. Hey, hey, hold it right there. You, is this the, uh, I think this is like the, the, the red and blue Goomba. It is! Aha, you're Mario! I knew it! You couldn't get past here, Mr. Big Shot! <laughs> God, that's valid. It's a direct order from the Goomba King, that's right. I'm sorry, but the only way by here is through the Goomba Bros. That's me, Red Goomba, and my brother, Blue Goomba. It's Roomba and Bloomba. Let's get him, Bloomba! Oh yeah, let's do it, my Roomba! My Roomba, my Boomba, and me. It's my favorite podcast. This is Blow Goomba. He's the younger of the two notorious Goomba Bros. Max HP 6, attack fire. Okay, okay, okay. As you heard in his little speech, he's one of the Goomba King's men. He doesn't look that. <laughs> he doesn't look that healthy. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, that fucking killed me. <laughs> well, it's not even, it's not even like clothes, it's like, it's like skin color. It's like, just like my name. Is that why they named Walter White that? Yeah, I'm surprised they didn't go for um, uh, like a clear like Mario and Luigi comparison. Mario, how'd you like some of this? All he can do is just like cough and sit down because he because he apparently <laughs> doesn't look very healthy. Oh wait, no, I didn't mean to head off. Oh wait, 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 wait. I, I know I know how to respond to this. That there from Breaking Bad. <laughs> he was just a sick boy. Why did you have to kill him? Okay, let's see what. <laughs> like, I'm gonna read these tiles actually because they're very funny. This is Red Goomba. He's the older of the two notorious Goomba brothers. The Goomba King ordered him to try and stop you. You can take this guy, no problem. He has just a little more HP than an ordinary Goomba.
Thank you for the game that time. I'm gonna fucking kill you. Just like your brother. Yes, killing, violence, hurting, and hurting, and attacking. What now? Why would you fucking lie to me like that? Oh, there's Chloe's up there right now. I find that when I try to do a Mario voice, um, it either tends to, like, be the normal sort of- Oh, <laughs> oh my god, Chloe. You're you're killing me at least. I'm gonna put Walter Mario in there. I might crank up the um uh let's make it there. Now it should trip it should flip a little faster. Walter. Walter Mario. Wario. Breaking Bad is Wario origin story. I really like the instrument that just goes Whoa! in the background of this. Google King's Fortress ahead. Sweet, if. <laughs> if. Goompa say he needs to go to Toad Town to, to buy a mushroom or something. He has to traverse through this <laughs> through this entire ass castle. Mario beat us up. I'll fucking do it again in a moment's notice. He has blue overalls. Big if true. Hey, look, Mario, see that building over there? I'm pretty sure that used to be a bri be a bridge on the other side. I wonder what happened to it. Or, or is, is Goomba King Fortress a new installment? <laughs> so, Mario, it's true you made it this far. I respect you for that. Unfortunately, this is as far as you'll ever get. Because I, the great and powerful King Goomba. Oh, wait. <laughs> he is quaking in fear. Look at that text shaking. So just. Because I, the great powerful King Goomba. He says, well, that, no, that sounds like I'm being, like, shaken. Because the, 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 the great Goomba and the, the great and powerful Goomba, Goomba King will see the, 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 that you advance no f f f f f further. You hear that? You hear that, Mario? No farther, not one step. <laughs> Are you scared, little man? Ah -ha! I'm, <laughs> I'm apparently not looking very healthy still. Wow, that King Goomba's really huge. I'm sure he's no match for you, though, Mario. Let's overthrow a monarchy. Ready to meet, Ready to meet your wrath, Mario. Mario, you better be. <laughs> That's valid. Beat him up, King. Beat him up, King Goomba. We got your back. Leave him to me. Pick up Goomba Masters. I know how to play this game, motherfucker. Oh, what? Goomba, you can't. Damn it. I'm working on it. I, I don't need to worry about FP. I'll just use the Goomba tree against him. I just need to not die first. <laughs> oh, 
Well, I'll just do a do all three at once. Two damage. <coughs> oh Jesus Christ! I only have one other mushroom. There we go. There we go. We got that. Because of fucking kids. Young lady who just dies here. Oh shoot! I need to. I need to tattle him. They're both his court jesters. <laughs> Damn. He's the boss of he's the boss of Red Goomba and Blue Goomba. Who cares if he's strong? You're much stronger. Gee, I wonder what he ate to become so big. I'd like to be a bit bigger too. <laughs> he just roundhouse kicks me. Yeah, Mario beheads King Goomba and sticks his head on a pipe. Don't you remember that from from Paper Mario? <laughs> oh, I love that! Level up, baby! I'm going to do fucking health. I could do it. Cool! Victory! I'll get the... I'll do what I always do. I just go HP, FB, BP, HP, FB, BP, HP, FB, BP, HP, FB, BP. Like, I just go over and over again. Wait, is is 27 divisible by 3? Because if so, that could work. 27 divided by 3. It is! Perfect. So, that means... So, so each one should be able to get leveled up nine times. HP, FB, BP. So I just go from left to right. Should have equipped this actually. Perfect. <laughs> what is he doing in there? Okay, I thought I did that forever, bitch! Goomba, your pals is that you hit you hit the switch well, right? Of course, King Goomba, I hid in the grass inside the fortress. Outside that, you idiot! You did not hide in here! Mario will find it for sure! This house will be a fucking tomb! Mm -hmm. uh, Mario could fight and all that. I must warn you, however. If you happen to find a stage switch somewhere, you should definitely not present. It's dangerous, understand? You already pressed it. <laughs> oh no! I'll see you in hell. Although, <laughs> the goddamn windows fall off. <laughs> I'm glad you like evil Paper Mario. Where'd he fucking go? <laughs> oh, I mean, he is brutal. He just sent that guy into the sun. Look, the bridge. Now we can cross it and continue our journey. All right. Oh, all right. <laughs> Harder than I've ever done. Can I hit this tree? I can. Nice. <laughs> no, that wasn't God who did that. That was a function that he himself set. That was like, oh. Oh, nice. What? What is this? Can I, can I like... Oh wait, I can spin! I thought that was something I unlocked. Nice. I'm jamming. Like, that house is irrecoverable now. He like blasted it apart. But that was also its intention. It did as it was programmed to. 
<laughs> Save and continue. <gasps> twig time! Twig moments! Was that the first chapter? Oh, uh, I guess that was the prologue. King Baz, I've been looking for you. I apologize, even this, but I defeated the Goomba King. <laughs> He's heading for downtown now. What unbelievable! What was Goomba King thinking? Making his house a bridge like that. <laughs> Wait, the Star Rod has the ability to um, uh, instill monarchies? Use a star rod to make them a king because he begged me. Mario whips him so easily. What a whip! Uh, Kenny Koopa, you are sure that Mario can never defeat us, right? Please, Peter Billy, let's try to become Koopa King the small time. I had a feeling he'd fail. I bet money on it. It doesn't matter because while you hold the star rod, you are definitely invincible. You can beat Mario with one claw tied behind your back. <laughs> well, Goombario said that Mario could beat Bowser with one hand tied behind his back, so it was just going to be a one-armed fight. <laughs> it made, um, per the Goomba King's request, uh, Bowser made the blue, the blue Goomba not very healthy. Gave him, like, not great lung capacity and, like, jaundice yes exactly Chloe exactly by the way Kenny Koopa and those star spirits we captured don't have any way of giving Mario their power do they please don't worry yourself each is held separately and each is carefully guarded by your hand picked subjects even Mario can save all seven of the star spirits Who's the, <laughs> Who's the closest star spirit to Mario? It's what? Oh my god, I'm losing my voice. <laughs> it's the one at Koopa Bros Fortress, right? If Mario somehow reaches there, can the Koopa Bros defeat him? King Bowser, you must set away. Oh, that was the Koopa Bros. Hiya! I'm fucking blinded. Here come the Koopa Bros. Uh-huh, oh yeah, we're the coolest of the cool. Gabby Goomba, are you sure these guys can get the job done? That Goomba kid was gigantic, and even he couldn't beat Mario. Asha, get real, King Bowser. Yeah, the Goomba King was huge, but we was a total wimpola. We're nothing like him. My best friend, the Koopa Bros. See, what we've got going is the power of teamwork. Together we can... <laughs> this is just a polycule. Together we can put the hurt and Mario in seconds flat. Excellent, that's the spirit of silent Koopa Bros. Yeah, they're either a, a, a Ninja Turtles or a Power Rangers, like, parody. Shall I keep that special attack you so well? Yes, ma'am. Ready, everybody? <laughs> they just dropped a flashbang in Bowser's living room. Oh! oh! This is... Oh! He is experiencing extreme pain. How'd you like it, King Bowser? How was it? Oh, yeah. Excellent. Really? I'm not easily impressed either. Mario would have a chance if you finish it with that attack. He makes the Emma, the the King Har the King Harkinian. Oh, <laughs> no, that's not good. The oh, the, that noise. We'll take him, King Bowser. By the way, by the way, my Koopa Bros, about the captured Star Spirit I've locked up in your fortress. Who's guarding him right now? Uh, nobody, sir. You know we're here, and so. You idiots! Use your head! Get back to the Star Fortress and guard that Star Spirit! Mm. 
How's that a sheep? That just looks like flawed. God, I hope <laughs> there aren't too many other Bowser sections. That one destroyed my throat. Can I not hammer up? I can only hammer right to left. Okay. Ooh, hammer throw. Another badge. Uh, first playthrough in around a decade. I have played the, I played this game back when I was younger, but this is my first time in a very long time playing it. I do my classic jump. Oh god, no. Please, <laughs> my throat. Mario, it's so glad you're okay. The whole town is an uproar. The princess kidnapped. The fairy castle uprooted. It's Bedlam. Isn't that the name of the Shadow Siren, or is it Beldum? I really don't know what we can do about <coughs> all of this. Please, why you save our highness? I'll never talk to your kind again, just to save my throat. Is there anything good in here? Because I do not think I have any mushrooms. Oh, I have the super mushroom. I'm fine. It is pain. <laughs> the the um the amount I give away for my craft of doing bad toad voices. Ooh. I'll get that later. Oh, I'm not talking to you guys. <laughs> this is my final stream. Everything else will be done post mortem. I hope you um join in next week for my um uh, my live funeral. Who's this dude? Oh, these are these the masters. <laughs> I really like this guy's little hair. It looks like he looks like he's he looks like he's supposed to be a human ball and chain. Like you can just sort of grab him and swing him around. Above us is the top floor where there is a dojo. We are here always training at the dojo. Unless our master's in here, in which case the dojo's closed. A letter just arrived saying the master will return soon. We will train again soon. What's this? I can take that. Okay, that's just more toads. Oh, wait, there's the pipe over here. I, I want to go in the pipe. Oh, nice. What was Luigi singing there? What do you what do you all think would be Luigi's go-to song? I wonder where my brother Mario is right now. Sup, bitch! Oh Mario! It's you! Good to see you! I died by um dooming Bowser's voice for <laughs> for an intended uh, period of time and it was destroying me. And you're all right. He, um, actually, he was singing 100 Gex, and he, he wasn't doing any of the um, uh, the um, the voice altering. He just did that himself. After you're all and you're all right. After that castle craziness, I was really worried about you. I ran outside just as the earthquake started, so I managed to escape in time. Did you adopt another child? Oh, and who are you? Mario, he's gonna have to sleep outside. I'm go oh. <coughs> Hi, goodbye, and nice to meet you. I see. <laughs> great. Just great. You're on it. Oh, he actually is pissed. You're on an exciting adventure with Mario. Talk about unfair. Luigi is fucking pissed. See, someone has to look after this house, so I can't leave. Oh well, take care, Mario. Okay. Angry Luigi just sounds significantly older. What are these? Just 
he was given the gift of speech, which also gave him the gift of <laughs> various mental illness. Behind the pipe? Oh, from like this? Or did you mean the other pipe? Yeah, I'll look at it. I mean, it would make sense. Cool. <sighs> so, it gives you badges, star pieces. I know it gives you recipes as well. Uh, I'm not sure what the other three are, though. I know Luigi's diary is somewhere in here. I, I won't breach his privacy just yet. Bye, Bother, I'll never see you again. What's this place? Toad Town Newsflash. <laughs> Princess Peach kidnapped. Castle uprooted. This happened like half an hour ago. Y'all work fat. A few. D oh, yeah, I forgot. Mario was comatose for a while. A few days ago, Princess Peach Castle was stolen. She was inside and was produced, presumed kidnapped. Whereabouts of the princess are? How about her castle? Wait, do, do they not know where the castle is? Like, are, are Toads like I'm a... He wants both. He wants to lay down sideways. He wants to, um, he wants to sleep on it like they do in Cyberpunk where they like just their head is on the bed and the rest drapes off but for luigi the rest will drape off down onto the bottom bunk okay we got the post oh this one we have a paracarry i think this is where the castle is <laughs> he'll sleep outside with gumbario And this is where uh, Shooting Star Hill is, if I remember correctly. Yes, it is. Shooting Star Summit. There. What's that here? There's something to, I'm not gonna talk to my, my lovely. For panels, do I need something to, um, uh, don't I need, like, ground pound to, um, uh, be able to open them yet? Or was I just not really doing too much? <gasps> Mama fucking me, I got it with a star piece. Okay. Well, that's fine. I'll have to be going back there anyways to make sure I haven't missed my count. Of course. I mean, you sent me Walter White Mario, so like... <laughs> it's, I've, I'm already chock full of curses. I really like the aesthetic of this place. It's quite pretty. Maybe it's just because, like, the coloring of the floor and stuff is a cool aesthetic. It, it, it's a lot like a, a reflected night sky. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. I remember seeing that image. Um... <laughs> it's the image of muscular Luigi wearing the very tight thong. I, I will not subject you all to it. Oh shoot, it's, it's Grandpa.
What do you mean the other day? Peach was kidnapped multiple days ago. Grandpa's a little senile. He doesn't get his dates right. Stara is powerful beyond weep. Belief, it can grant any wish. For as long as we can remember, Bowser has been making wishes like, for instance, I'd like to trap Mario. I want Princess Peach to be mine. Of course. <laughs> oh no, you deleted it. A muscular thong Luigi is now now gone from our from our eyes, but not from our hearts. Of course, stars ignore such selfish wishes. As a result, his wishes are never granted. Bowser, that fiend. When he found out that we were ignoring his wishes, he came and stood this hard as he could create his own wishes. He seems content right now, mainly because he defeated you and kept the princess. Soon enough, though, I fear he will wish for more, and then terrible things will happen. Bowser's got insane self-control if he has basically infinite wishes, and he only wished to be powerful and to make one do to king. It is the responsibility of the seven star spirits to keep the star rod safe and use it properly. We must get the star rod back from Bowser and return it to its rightful place. In order to do this, Mario, we even need your help. Sadly, right now we are not strong enough to challenge Bowser. He has made himself all powerful by making wishes with the star rod. He is terrible to behold. Once we seven star spirits are reunited in Star Haven, we can give you the power to fight Bowser even with his newfound strength. With that help, you can prevail. Mario, we are. Alas, we nearly exhausted our power to talk to you. Although it looks like you're there beside, we're there beside you, it is only an illusion. We're using all of our strength to communicate you with over the great distance, but even now, our strength is failing. We've been caught and are being held by Bowser's followers in different places throughout the Mushroom Kingdom. Please, Mario, first of all, you must rescue us. It looks like this thing is a lot more serious than I thought. Sounds like I'm a... Uh, someone uses Reddit. Don't you think the princess is gonna be alright? I'm really worried about her. Are we gonna get another peach scene? <laughs> yeah, like the Polar Express train kid. Exactly! Oh my god, please don't make me voice Bowser. Sniffing. Mario's probably hurt. Everyone's in prison. The Mushroom Kingdom will be destroyed if things continue the way they're going. <laughs> Something must be done. If only someone could help me. A twink, perhaps. Oh, no, my throat. I might... You've never watched the Polar Express? I've watched- my family watches it like every Christmas. Also, um, I might call it after this cutscene, just cause my voice is starting to kill me, and um, soon my family is gonna be home and then my Wi-Fi will be completely uh, unable to stream stuff. Yo, I'm like that with Cars 2, um, not the watching it in summer, or the being able to say half of it in my sleep. Uh, when I was a kid, uh, I was very scared of the dark, and I was, <laughs> basically, I, I listened to, like, music and stuff to help me fall asleep, and on my old, like, blue basic iPod, I had a bunch of random songs that I can't remember, and Cars to the Movie. Um, so what would happen was, 
every night before going to bed, I would listen to the audio of Cars 2. So now, I know that movie off by heart. It is etched into my brain like a tattoo. I, but I, I couldn't tell you what the visuals are like, though. For all I know, Cars 2 is strictly an audio medium. It could have no visuals for all I care, because all I know are <laughs> the amazing vocal works. Oh god, here. I don't think the Pope-mobile has any lines. Which is like why maybe I never truly enjoyed it, because I never got to see the Pope-mobile. Okay, god, here we go, buzzer time. <coughs> My dear Butchers Peach, how are you doing this fine day? Oh my god, you can you can hear the quality of my voice degrading. It's no use waiting for Mario this time, my dear. It's so high. I'm not reading the rest of that. Cami and Bowser just absolutely boofed out of their mind right now. You know, Princess, as long as I have this star run, no one in the big mushroom kingdom can touch me. You know the power that grants everyone wishes? It's mine. Isn't that just wonderful? <laughs> Imagine what kids like down in your kingdom. Your subjects must be so insane because their wishes are being granted. Oh, how delightful. They deserve it for the way they've treated us. Okay, so there is really, like, a race issue between the Mushroom Kingdom and Koopas. Dang. If you... <laughs> Cunt got him a uh, censor there, but I'll, I'm gonna let you speak the truth of the, the, the car Catholic Church. If you, you know, want anything, all you need to do is ask my princess. I can grant wishes. Of course, it'll only grant requests that I like. Anyway, think about it. You take care, Princess Peach. Enjoy your stay here. You know what, you said, princess, you better not cause trouble. <laughs> oh man, I'm gonna need to figure out a car, uh, not, oh my god. Y'all made me got hooked cars on the brain. Uh, I need to figure out a voice for Twink. Oh please, if somebody could help me. Princess Peach, pleased to meet you. Oh, that, that's too much like uh, just a higher pitched Goombario. My name is Twink. But you're you're a star kid, aren't you? Oh, but you're you're a star kid, aren't you? How'd you get here? I came from Star Haven to grant your wish. It's our job to grant wishes, you know. I'm really trying hard to um, uh, not give Twink a southern voice, but it's slowly morphing into Gideon from Gravity Falls. Uh, yeah, you're you're good too. You might get, like, it might get auto-censored, but I can fix that. It's our job to grant wishes, you know? Oh, I'll click that there. Oh, you came because I wish that somebody could help me? Yes, of course. Wait. The whole point of the Star Rod is it grants wishes. So how the hell was Twink able to do this? The whole point of them wanting the Star Rod back is because they can't grant wishes without it. Oh, that's just great. Thank you so much for coming. Here's my wish. Go right now and take that star run back from Bowser, okay? Think you can do it? Whoa, another live. Howdy. Thank you for the follow. Ah, uh, mm. oh, sorry. That's a little much for a novice star like me. Maybe one of the Arnival Star Spears from Star Haven could grant a wish like that. I'm so sorry. Please, ask for something easy, something a small star could do. Then, can you take me away from here? Everyone in this castle has been captured, and I have to save them all as soon as possible. Which is why I'm asking you to literally help me abandon them and ride off. Oh, I'm sorry. I really can't do jack shit apparent. I really can't do jack shit apparently. Actually, I just called up 
to the sky a day ago, so I can't do big wishes yet. Peach's only alley is a literal day-old infant. If I were a more splendid star, maybe I could act... Oh, excuse me. Maybe I could actually help. It's alright. Don't be sad. <laughs> Doink. Mario will definitely do something to save us all. He'll prob he's probably coming right now. <gasps> oh, <laughs> Twink. Do you think you can find Mario? I want you to give this to him. This is a lucky star, isn't it? Okay, I'll do it, Princess Peach. I'll fly to the Mushroom Kingdom just as quick as I can. Oh, wait, Twink. Wait one second. Can you also... Please tell Mario that. I'm fine, and he shouldn't worry. Okay? Can you tell him that? Of course! I'll tell him your exact words, Princess Peach. Definitely. Now, don't despair. I'll be back soon, so stay still. Oops. So stay safe until I return, okay? Mario, where are you? Okay, where's the save block? I'll save and then I'll call it. After Mario. <laughs> That's how they assassinated JFK. They threw Twink at him. Oh, sorry. Sorry. So sorry. I'm in a huge hurry. Oh, it's... You're Mario, aren't you? Thanks the stars I found you. <laughs> how do you do? I'm Twink. Princess Peach asked me to bring you something to you. Uh, yes, here it is. Take it. You got the lucky star. Star shape pendant. Let's you use the action command. Oh, that's how I do timed attacks. That's interesting. Huh. I never really thought about it being a actual tangible thing that allows Mario to do that. Huh. That's interesting. That's the lucky star from Princess Peach. Now that it's yours, you can use the action command. May I know? This is important, Mario. Stop it. Oh, okay. Great. Don't even have to explain. I really wish that was like a, um, uh, a chapter 4 Super Paper Mario without the helmet thing. Where if you if you say no enough times, it just game overs you. Once you understand how to use the ash command properly, you'll be even more powerful. Terrific. You'll be much tougher in battle now. I think this is candy. There you are. Can't wait, what? You transitioned fast. What? You can't be? Were you following me? What a foolish star. What a foolish star, kid. Well, I know one of them is at the very start when Merlin tries to give you the, Chris, the, the pure heart. There's the second one with Tippy and Space. What's the third one? I knew that if I followed you, I'd find Mario. If I defeat Mario right now, I'd be famous. I'll tell. Oh, this is <coughs> this is this is complicating my theory. Uh, let's just say Cammy can time travel. I'll tell Cammy Koopa. She'll shower me with praise. She'll give me a raise. Did did Cammy always have a tail? Is that a tail back there, or is that just the? Oh, okay. That makes sense. Um, is that a tail, or is that part of his robe? Because I don't think I've ever noticed... Here I come! Never noticed him having a tail before. Sweet, we can kill him. Oh! Wait, no, never mind. This isn't Kamek. This is just a Magic Koopa. So, uh, my theory still holds. Perfect. Transcamic lives on. I don't know if I'm hitting that one or not. I think I'm missing up the, um, the attacks. Don't 
have tails. I fucking killed them. I've introduced this child to the concept of death at day two of existence. Well done, Mario. You're as strong as they say. I knew that you'd be able to defeat Bowser. I'm going to return to Princess Peach's side. I'm not strong enough to really help her, but at least I can tell her you're okay. Well, Mario, see you later. Well, I thought all Koopas had tails. I guess except for, like, dry bones and stuff where they don't got no flesh. Oh dear, I almost forgot to tell you the message from Princess Peach. I'm alright, so don't worry about me. That's exactly what she said. I get the feeling, though, that she's very... <laughs> okay. It's a bit of a... Inference there. But please be brave. You must save Princess Peach. Um, they actually cut off the Koopa tails and are a fine delicacy. That's why um, Kami was talking about the rocky relationship between Mushroom Kingdom and Koopas. Because they keep doing that. Fuck off, Twink. There he goes, back to Bowser's castle. What a brave little guy. Okay, Mario, let's get down to business. Please let me... Please just let me save. My throat is killing me. Once again, I forgot I could spin. Oh, oh, oh ending my voice off with a, with a bang. Oh, Mario! Merlin was lucky for you. You understand? I was with the spinning room. He asked me to tie the Kobe to many things. I was just about to call him for you, but here you are. Zachary Mellon, I was out of his house. Don't worry, stream's gonna end in like two minutes, anyways. He's a bit of a centrist, but he has been as a strap. I have to come out of the house at all. Destroyed. Where's the safe block? Please. 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 Where is it? Here it is. Where's the safe block? I'm begging you. I just want the save. Please. Okay. <laughs> well, that was Paper Mario. That <laughs> that was a lot of fun. I was um, this has been the um, uh, like five different new stream things for me at once. New new setup. New thing with the capture card so <laughs> this is all new territory for me but it went really well and i i had a blast this was this was a ton of fun yeah this is blue this is um paper mario blue it's the new game that came out and i'll, I'll put it on this one so <laughs> i'll put it on my good old my good old brb thing but yes this was this was fun um i'm probably gonna play this again next week same time make it a weekly thing until i get through it but yeah thank you what app do you use to stream? Um, I use Streamlabs OBS. I haven't really messed with Sony Vegas or anything. But yeah, that's what I use. Um, and yeah, thank you uh, everybody for tuning in. It was it was a lot of fun to have you. I I hope you all have a good day, and I will see you next stream. Uh, bye bye.